All right, so this is just me triaging the whole low population on my progs situation. Um, there's a whole bunch of them in a little spot. Figure out where they are. They're kind of out here in the big void, not the, the little void. And this is five of them right now, which is almost half of their current population. This is going to make it really easy to triage this particular set. I'm just going to set meat to pellet size to 10 and pellet number to 10, and I'm going to feed the crap out of them. And I'm going to press play. So there's four of them there. Five of them there because eggs. Six of them there because eggs. And I'm going to go figure out where the other population is. I'm going to feed him. I'm going to figure out that's a wandering prog, which is interesting because what is it doing over here? Let's take a look and make sure it is what I think it is. That is a prog wanderer. These guys live over here. So this is going to cause some interesting things to happen. Uh, there's 150 of those, which means that they've probably already migrated. Yep, here they are. We have a, success, a successful migrant, and that's what happens when the prog population drops. Uh, it makes it a lot easier to cross the gaps. Uh, we don't want more prog wanderers. We want more of these guys. Where are the that guy right there? This is who we want to feed. Look at how big you are. Uh, so this is almost 2x maturity. And it is coming from the gas station. So give that one some food and then try to find another one. Give this one some food, see how it's doing. It's full. And we should watch the prog population explode from here. Uh, we're going to watch the one, this one right here, where there's a whole bunch of progs. Let's take one of the babies and watch how this works. So growth is kind of low right now, which is interesting because these things uh, are usually programmed to grow when they're biting something. I'm not sure why it's not. This could also be a non-viable mutant. Yeah, want to grow just isn't flaring up. So this one's not going to grow. So let's take a more interesting sample. Here we go. This one is in fact growing. It is growing at 2.72 energy per second. I'm getting that lag, that lag stutter. It's not the, f I did turn down the uh, pheromone, but for some reason it still takes a second to think about life and catch up. All right. We are almost at maturity. The egg size on these guys is 199. We are past maturity. Now we're just catching up to egg size. This one's going to start laying. And when it does, it's going to lay fast. Three, two, one, egg. Since we already have meat, it's just going to fill up. It turns growth down. Nope. Growth is still at 2.67. So it is growing rapidly and it laying eggs. We should get another egg in right now. <clears throat> this, uh, this is going to create a bunch of monster progs. We already have one prog becoming a monster, but we're going to keep watching this guy. So that's the third egg. There's going to be a fourth in three, two, one egg? Question mark? No egg. There's egg. So we don't have any egg behavior here. So it's really just coming down to lay time. We do have a long lay time. You combine that with the, where's the clock? Clock speed of 0.14. That's a really long lay time. So that's what, that's what keeps, um, keeps progs from laying eggs to death currently. And we have that weirdo's behavior who's going to eat the monster prog I don't know what it's doing. That is an interesting mutation. I'm going to watch it, try to figure out what it is. So we have a single negative in the uh, negative 0.29 on number of meats. 
uh, but that doesn't matter now because it is officially did. D-E-D. -E okay. So let's just, just watch these guys and see what happens. They are right next to... Nope. This is what's happening. They have already found the Northwest Island and are consuming its cons its inhabitants. Rip that trap mite. Uh, rip that uh, small guy. Rip that small guy. Rip that small guy. Rip this... Nope. Rip this small guy. Okay. How are you doing? Because you just ate a whole bunch of SG. It's missing a little bit of health because small guys bite. Um, but it doesn't seem to mind. It's going to eat this prog. It's going to lay eggs. So this guy's this guy's a champion. Uh, and he's also quite fast. Speed ratio of 0.44, and we are turbo mode. Uh, so it is likely going to head over to the gas station at this point. Or not. Or not doesn't really matter. We have 62 progs right now, so I'd consider this situation triaged. We have... Meh. All right. So it's doing a champ doing its championship job. It's coming back here to the spawning pool. And I should have just left it selected because it's going to do some interesting stuff. Um, I count this guy is dead. Yeah, get it. And it's going to lay two more eggs. Just watch. One egg. Two egg. Take a look at this again. So 17 and 0.1. So really like 100 and... It's like a two-minute timer on that, which is kind of cool. It's a good way for it to disperse eggs across a wide area. Uh, still full health, or not still not, not just full health, but full energy, minus now, because that egg is going to go eat them, probably. Or whatever. Back to the spawning pool. It's going to fill itself back up. It's going to either that or going to get eaten by a prog. It's getting eaten by a prog. And that is an unfortunate reality of being a prog is you're probably going to get eaten. All right. I'm not interested in watching the spawning pool anymore. Let's figure out what's going on. Progs don't seem to be very uh, super effective at eating small guys. It's more like, oh, these things are here as I'm passing through. I'm going to grab a couple snacks on the way. And then they have to immediately recover because, again, small guys bite. Which is a, a good thing, right? I need these things to train up to a point where they have solid healing capacity. And I haven't done any engineering whatsoever with their healing. So this is Southwest Island. I'm not seeing any progs. I do see an MRE baby. MREs currently are definitely not claiming a niche. No. So considering what they are, I'm probably not going to keep them around until they are a bit better at reproducing. Here, that's what I was hoping for, a prog to come down here on the Southwest Island. They're still pretty stupid. They still grab plants from the middle of a pile of meat. So one of these days that of that behavior will be evolved out. It it is not today because evolution takes time. And while while you may know or think you know what something needs in order to survive, the sim makes very different decisions. And I don't really feel like going in here and trying to rewire their brain right now so i'm not going to do that but yeah that's that is an unfortunate reality of a predator is occasionally you, you do have to watch their population especially when you make large changes to the biome like embiggenating the islands 
increasing their fertility and adding a whole new one in. I'm probably going to have to do it again. Anyways, 10 minutes is up.